Izzy was born mute with two left hands, so she couldn't write. She was the only daughter of her parents because her mother couldn't conceive no matter how much she tried. Till she finally conceived and gave birth to a daughter. A diamond who everyone called a miracle baby and beauty worth millions at such a young age. When she grew older, Izzy's mom would always leave the four years old with Izzy at home and go to the market. Some days, the little girl would cry to follow her, but she never agreed. Whenever she would come home, she would notice that the ambience of the house is not calm. She tried asking Izzy what's the matter, but no matter how Izzy tried, she couldn't understand what she was saying, and Izzy always end up crying. Every day, Izzy would try to tell her something, but she just couldn't make out what she wants to say because she didn't understand sign language, and no matter how much she made Izzy try to write it, it wouldn't work. This kept on going on for a while and troubled her mind. Even her young child who always comes to hug her with a smile whenever she comes back from the market doesn't do that anymore. She couldn't concentrate in the market, so she decided to go back home early. When she reached their compound, their door was opened. Feeling confused, she pushed the door and walked in, ready to scold Izzy for leaving the door open. When she caught Oladibo, their neighbor's son on top of her four years old daughter, who was crying and bleeding and Izzy in the corner crying her eyes out. I guess she finally understood what Izzy wanted to say, 